welcome to another episode today we'll be seeing a story sorry no mind no mirror and uh, this is about the master hui nan who in his initial stages as a young man went to his master the monastery he wanted to join the monastery as a disciple and when the master saw him he said don't come here it is bound to happen at any time there is no need for you to learn anything no need to come here and uh, hui nan was uh, was a bit worried that master was thus just uh, sending him away without giving any instructions without admitting him as a disciple so he pleaded with him no please admit me in your monastery as your disciple he said it is not possible after much pleading he accepted okay i'll admit you as a servant in the kitchen not as a disciple you can stay there but don't come to me again there is no need for you to come to me again unless i call for you so he now went to the kitchen he worked on all the menial jobs in the kitchen washing cleaning sometimes helping the cooks and 12 years he was doing that all this time others were carrying out reading of scriptures meditation meetings prayers all this were happening under the instructions of the masters and the huinang was never part of this he was doing only all the cleaning and other minor jobs in the kitchen for four years and everybody took him as granted he was not counted He was merely a servant. It was a huge monastery of 500 people, and he was just a nobody. And as the years passed by, after 12 years, the master was becoming ill. He knew that his time was near. it's go he is going to die soon so he wanted to appoint a successor among his disciples so he told them on a particular wall in this wall today if somebody writes a four line poem and if it is found true and good then i will appoint him as a successor as head of this monastery so there were lot of talks which was going on throughout the day and there was one particular disciple who was well versed in all the scriptures he excelled in all the meditation exercises he was calm and quiet man so this man everybody thought he will be appointed the successor and everybody knew he was going to win others are no match for him so this person 
in the night went and wrote the four lines though he did not write his name he wrote mind is like a mirror and dust gathers on it clean the dust and you are enlightened so what he wrote was mind is like a mirror the dust gathers on it clean the dust and you are enlightened next day morning the master came saw the four lines and declared who are wrote this is enlightened everybody knew it was this particular disciple who wrote it though he did not write the name so this person is going to be appointed as a successor so all the people after their morning ritual came to the kitchen for food and uh, the kitchen the dining hall was agog with the conversation thus that this disciple is going to be the next master and they were discussing about the four lines he wrote the four lines the mind is like a mirror and dust gathers on it you clean the dust and then you are enlightened hearing this coin and lock everybody was talking with reference admiration and here is hunan on hearing this he began to laugh this irritated the monks who had come there for dining for their food he said you are a lowly servant for 12 years you have not did nothing but cleaning this place and cleaning the utensils and as a helper you are not even graduated to be a cook master chef and you are laughing at this what do you know about this enlightenment or what do you know about anything on zen when i told no i am not an enlightened one i don't know to read or write but i know this is wrong then they challenged him can you write what is enlightenment okay i'll come to the wall but i don't know to read and write so someone accompany me i'll tell you and you write on the wall so couple of guys went with hoinan and uh, he told them there is no mind there is no mirror and there is no dust who ever understands this and what is the place to there is no mind there is no mirror and why will the dust gather who are understands this is enlightened there is no mind there is no mirror and why will the dust gather who are understands this is enlightened this was written on the wall after some time the master came he saw that he told this is wrong who are wrote this this is wrong so the su- successor was anointed and everybody who were all who were always thinking that this particular disciple will be become the master that happened the great master appointed him as the successor twin and continued his duty as a cleaning boy the kitchen servant and that night he was sleeping and someone woke him up he saw that master was standing there waking up waking him up he said get up 
the moment you came to this monastery 12 years ago i knew that already you are on the verge of enlightenment and at any moment that is bound to happen with me or without me that's why i told you to go back but you served here and you are already enlightened enlightened doing this job piously as your meditation now you are enlightened and what you had written today that there is no mind there is no mirror and there is no place to gather dust that is true that is the truth nobody knows that you are already enlightened but i if i tell this and if i appoint you as a successor people will kill you because they never thought you as one among them they thought you as a servant as a menial servant so somebody will kill you so run away from this place go somewhere else you are already in life that so this is the story It's the story how a uh, queen attained enlightenment so it is not about reading the scriptures or doing meditation or joining a monastery it is about understanding the truth the truth that there is no mind there is nothing all these are merely projection of the mind if you understand that then that is enlightenment and the aura surrounds you people understand by that that you are enlightened nobody need to tell that so this is a story of no mind and no mirror this is retold by our show in his book of secrets the book of secrets from that the story is told so with this we will end this episode stay with me for another episode subscribe to my channel share this video thank you